Hi, I'm Tim from Skydemon. Welcome to this week's top tip. Under the airfields tab, for every airfield, you'll find approach information. This contains all the information you're likely to need to make an approach to or take off from an airfield. Let's start with a larger airfield like Bournemouth. At the top is the current QNH and density altitude, and what the wind is doing. These are taken from the latest METAR issued by the airfield. Below those are the frequencies and runways offered by the airfield, and also links for any radio navigation aids and VRPs, which highlight those things on the map when clicked. Under the runway information, you'll see the crosswind and head or tailwind components have been worked out. Let's look at a smaller strip, Wadswick. We've got the same frequency and runway information. And like most strips, Wadswick doesn't publish a METAR, but Skydemon has obtained the QNH from the nearest airfield that does, which is Bristol. It has estimated the density altitude at Wadswick from Bristol's METAR and is showing the forecast wind. This will never be as good as an actual windsock or METAR, which is why it's labelled as a forecast, but is helpful for planning purposes. For our full user manual, go to skydemon.aero and choose Help and Support.